Did you know that Islam is split into two main groups who are often at war? When Muhammad died in 632 CE, his followers were split over how to choose a successor. The Sunnis wanted the successor to be chosen by his followers, known as a caliph, and proposed his companion and father-in-law, Abu Bakr. The Shias wanted the leadership of Islam to remain within Muhammad's bloodline, known as an imam, and proposed Ali ibn Abi Talib, his cousin. The Sunnis, being the larger group, got their way, and Abu Bakr was selected. The Sunnis then went on to choose the following two caliphs. The Shias, however, kept pushing for Muhammad's cousin, and in 656 they succeeded in electing him as the fourth caliph. In 661, Ali ibn Abi Talib was assassinated, and his son Hussein was denied a session. In 681, Hussein led a group of soldiers from Mecca to Kabla to confront the Sunnis, and in the following battle, he was killed. The death of Hussein remains a key dividing line between the Sunnis and Shiites to this day.